वेलकम टूडेज अमेजिंग सेशन विद शाबिहा योर मैथ्स टीचर एंड टूडे वी आर गोइंग टू डील विद द सेकेंड चैप्टर फ्रॉम योर सेवन स्टैंडर्ड मैथ्स टेक्सट बुक एंड द नेम ऑफ द चैप्टर इज एज यू कैन सी पैरल लाइन्स The first lesson is very well taught by Shubha teacher. I hope you all did it for up, right? Good. Then start our second chapter. Before we start, come, let's go to your place. Do you know where we are? Yes, this is a railway track. Do you notice any speciality on these two railway lines? Okay, let's go to another place. Yes, this is a running track. I know my dear student, you all are familiar with it. Now look at each line of this running track too. Same like railway track, right? I know all of you staying safe at home. No need to go outside. I will show you some example from your home itself. See these grills on this window. These bars are arranged in the same distance. Likewise, these two frames of this door. What about the lines going by extending a pair of opposite sides of a rectangle? Yes, they move at the same distance. Is it possible to collide somewhere? No. So, the lines which are at the same distance everywhere and do not meet anywhere are called parallel lines. So, running track, railway track, window, doors, scale are examples of parallel line. That means same distance everywhere and do not meet anywhere. Look around, I'm sure you can find more examples of parallel lines. So, please note it down in your notebook as your homework. Look at this quadrilateral. If we extend the top and bottom side, do they meet? No, because they are moving at same distance. If we extend the left and right side, do they meet? Yes, because these lines are in not at equal distance. So, this is not a parallel line. Is this picture is an example of parallel line or this one? No, this is not in equal distance. What about this? Here the lines are in equal distance and do not meet anywhere. Let's call it parallel. Coming to next topic. Don't you know how to draw a rectangle? What are the angles of a rectangle? We know that all angles are 90 degrees. Let's draw a rectangle of length 5 cm and breadth 3 cm. this we can find the opposite sides of a rectangle are parallel okay you understand how to draw a rectangle using set square what if we use another corner instead of square one let's check Does any pair of opposite sides meet when they extended? No. A quadrilateral like this with opposite sides are parallel and equal is called parallelogram. What is parallelogram? Look here, we know the lines which are perpendicular to another line are parallel. Any doubt? Okay, good. What will happen if the lines meet upward? Yes, they will meet. So what will happen if the lines extended downward? 
they will not meet but they are not in equal distance so how we make these two lines parallel let's check we need to slant these two lines 60 degree let's check how to draw this figure Okay, understand? Like this, you can make 40 degree slanted line as your homework in your notebook. Now let's draw a shape. Take your protractor and scale. Are you ready? Okay. Yes, this is a quadrilateral. A quadrilateral like this with the opposite sides parallel and equal is called parallelogram. So please draw this parallelogram in your notebook as your homework. Okay student, in this session we discussed about parallel lines, parallelogram and its features. In next class we will meet with another interesting part of this chapter. Stay home, stay safe, happy learning.